Hey everyone, this is a huge update in the California Assembly District 15 race. As of this evening, this Friday evening, Giovanna Beckles has taken the lead over Dan Cab. That's right, the Richmond City Council member Giovanna Beckles is now ahead of the Oakland District 1 Council member Dan Cal by 284 votes. As I um, look at this from my computer, I just got the report a little bit ago. Uh, the way this reads basically is the new votes came in 42.9%. Um, if we go through the dates from 5 June to 7 June to 8 June, uh, basically about 56.1% of new total of votes came from Alameda County uh, for uh, Beckles and 43.9 came from Contra Costa County and um, that went that put Beckles ahead as of right now as of this close of June 8th Cal received 79% of his total votes from Alameda County, only 20.1% from Contra Costa County in the newest vote report that came through finally Friday, Friday evening. So as of right now, the comparison is that Giovanna Beckles has 12,135 votes versus Dan Kalb's 11,851 votes. And that's um, recorded on the county and secretary of state's website and then put into a nice little chart. So that's the latest. And so you would say, how did that, why is that? Well. First of all, when the election ends, not all of the electoral votes, not the electoral votes, excuse me, all of your votes, not all of the votes are counted on that night. They're counted over a period of time and they have to basically be wrapped up by the 13th and then the final report's done by the 6th of July. But it's not all done that night. So the reports that come out in subsequent days, as has been the case with this race, which is not over still, and you get a bigger picture. Now, in this instance, this is the tail end of the California Assembly District 15's version of the top two system. What does that mean? It means that in this system, the top two vote getters, in this case, Buffy Wicks, and if the process were to stop today, Jovanka Beckles, would hold a runoff in November, okay? At first, it looked like it was gonna be Cal, and then of course, subsequent reports came through, and as they did, and the votes were counted, because Cal's lead was so small to begin with, it did got a little bigger at 304 votes, but it was still small. Now, we had a big shift, and someone pointed out to me, hey, uh, a lot of Contra Costa County didn't come through, and yet Alameda County did. And Contra Costa County's reporting was off by a full two days. Now it's here. So that's the latest right now. What a swing. We went from Friday morning and having Dan Calb ahead by 304 votes to Friday evening, late, and Jovanka Beckles being ahead by 284 votes. That's, that's, that's an incredible shift. Stay tuned for more. Subscribe to Zenny62 on YouTube.